Now, have you had, um, since you've been going to a lot of DFL events, have you had good access to all these events? Um, like, do you get credentialed ahead of time, or how, like, how have you gone about doing that? You know, I've just emailed. Uh, I've applied for credentials at the DFL convention in 2006. Uh, I applied for credentials here for this convention. Uh, and the turnout, they were very responsive in getting back to me, which I appreciate. I do believe, and I've said this before in my blog, that I do believe that, that conventions should be open to the opposition and to political parties. I think Republicans sh should let Democrat bloggers in and vice versa. From an openness standpoint, I think that's important to do. Yeah, because I know, I think we've had trouble getting into Republican congressional district uh, conventions. Yeah. I think I don't think it was CD6. Um, we weren't able to get in. I mean, do you know, can you provide any insight as to why that might know. be? I don't know. I'm not a member of the, of the sixth. I don't live in the sixth. I don't know, I don't know the reasons. It, it, seems that they are, it seems that there was, uh, I mean, a lot of these functions, it, it would certainly be the right. It would certainly be the right of the third district Democrats to not allow bloggers in. But this is a, a relatively open process, and I think it's, Repu I think, I think it's something that Republicans uh, sh should look upon mirroring in some regards. So I just believe from a blogging standpoint, from a blogger's perspective, these things should be open.